you had an evil in you. Sometimes you'll be dealing with a person and God will tell you, I can't pull you fully up until you get rid of this bitch. Or I can't pull you fully up until you get rid of this nigga. Because where I'm going to take you, they can't be a part of that because I know what they think in the middle of the night. I know how they feel about you for real. So get rid of this motherfucker. I need you to be gone. So if a person wants to walk, let them fucking walk. Let them walk. Let them walk because they might be a blessing leaving. And listen, in 2020, my life got cleared out with people. And my shit kept going up. Shit kept going up. So then once you really sit down and think about that, who is the person that loses when it's over? That was the problem. Because if I'm a fucked up nigga to you, ain't nothing good gonna happen to me. Nothing. If I'm a good nigga to you, my shit is going to go up and you're going to go down. This is simple. And everybody has been through some shit like that. That's why they can relate to it. They can say, damn, okay, me and her stopped rocking. I start going, I got a better job. My shit start going up more. Okay, cool. What happened for her? Nothing. That's, the, that's what your problem was. That's what your problem is. This shit's simple. If your life is better when you with a nigga, and you doing shit that you've never done, and he treating you that way, hey, bitch, kneel. Kneel, kiss the ring, because you won't find another one of them. Most niggas, when they meet women, they ain't coming in and changing your life. They coming in and busting ain't nothing, they leaving. They ain't showing you shit. They not showing you shit, they not going to upgrade you or nothing. So the nigga that shows you the most, you're going to have to kneel. If you don't kneel to that man, you nothing good going to happen to you. The next nigga that you get is going to be the same problem or worse because of the fact the way you did him. Call him real. I'm going to tell y'all something right now. Karma real. I, I've experienced it on both sides. I've experienced karma on being a bad person and the shit that came to me from that and being a good person. That shit is real. It's going to come. It's going to pull up when it want to pull up, but it's going to come. It's, the shit is going to come. Ain't nothing you can do about that. Karma is so real, you don't even understand that shit. What the energy you give out, that shit coming right back, bro. It coming right back. So that's why I try to be like, I like to, when I fuck with people, I like to show them love. I like to open my hand to them. Like a lot of people that or, you know, in periods of mind or something, they're not going to even talk to people that pull up. They're going to talk to the stars, and they're going to talk to them. I talk to everybody because I don't believe in a star. I go, okay, shit, she just in a better position than her. I believe in people, people as a whole. So I embrace people. So people embrace me.